Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Improvisor, back with another NBA 2K17 video. As you guys read in the title, I'll be going over the best dunk packages in NBA 2K17 for you guards out there, you point guards, you shooting guards, and you small forwards. If you're new to the YouTube channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button to keep up to date with this NBA 2K17 content and to help this channel grow. And I really appreciate your support. Let's get 300 likes on this YouTube video. But as you guys can see right here on my screen, I am already on my dunk package section. And the first dunk, dunk package that we'll be going over is the Russell Westbrook dunk package. I believe that the Russell Westbrook dunk package is the best dunk package for guards just because he does not do a lot of these dumb flashy animations. This Russell Westbrook dunk package literally it just gets to the point. He just jumps up really fast and he usually tomahawks the ball like he does in real life. Great second pick would be the Zach Levine dunk package. The Zach Levine dunk package is almost the exact same thing as the Russell Westbrook dunk package. The only difference is that the Zach Levine dunk package he jumps a little bit higher. The animations are a little bit slower. But still they both have good dunk animations out of both dunk packages. They will not get you blocked. That is the main theme with this dunks today's video. The only reason I have these basic 360 dunk packages to do them on fast break situations is the only time I do those and the under basket regular those aren't really that important they're just the under basket dunks. But definitely the best dunk package under the rim. Now these next four dunk packages are the most important for your my player success at the park and these next four will not get blocked these are the best in my opinion. As you guys are going to notice they're kind of similar they're all tomahawks practically. First we have coming up is the Uber athletic tomahawks off one. As you guys are going to notice in these upcoming clips, these dunk packages do not get blocked just simply because it is fast. It is fast literally. You just activate this dunk, have a little lane to the basket, and you will get a good animation out of it. It says it in the name, it's uber athletic, which means you're going to jump really high and you're going to get the ball in the basket really fast. Highly recommend you guys equip this to your my player right now. Next we have coming up are the baseline reverses off one. Now if you guys like are those type of players that like to drive baseline, this is the best baseline dunk package in the game. Simply because you will not get blocked. You will not slow down your progress when driving to the basket with this dunk package. As you guys are going to notice in these clips, I usually just beat my defender and I actually get a good dunk animation most of the time. I do not get slowed down. The wrong dunk package, I do not get blocked that often. Well, I highly recommend you try out these baseline reverses off one for the baseline, of course. Next, we have another Tomahawk dunk package, like I said, which are the straight arm Tomahawks. These are actually the dunk package I do the most for some damn reason. As you guys can see, even right here in this little preview, you can barely even see this dude dunk the ball. Which means they're extremely fast and effective at the park, so go ahead and try those out as well. Next, we have the Cockback Tomahawks. Now, out of all these Tomahawks, I would say that these Cockback Tomahawks are the most important because I really do get these animations frequently. As you guys are going to see in this clip, as soon as you beat your defender and you activate one of these dunk packages, it's over. For some reason, in NBA 2K16, if you had these Cockback Tomahawks equipped to your my player, you would most likely get blocked a lot of the time. I do not find that the case this year in NBA 2K17. I've had these dunk packages equipped to my my player since the beginning of this game. I truly believe that it is one of the best dunk packages in NBA 2K17. I do not get blocked with it. I get some crazy animations, especially with my point forward. My point forward is extremely tall, and I have this cockback tomahawk. Dunk package equipped, he does it really fast, which is crazy. Same thing with you centers out there. I'll go ahead and try it out for any, any position and any archetype. Now, the cradle dunks aren't one of the best dunk packages in the game. I just have it here because I want to talk to you guys about it. For some reason, if you centers or just you tall point forwards have this cradle dunk package equipped to your my player, for some reason he does a glitchy animation and he does it really fast. If you guys play NBA 2K17 or NBA 2K16, you guys already know that how fast you get these animations once you do these cradle dunks. 
And right here, I just included the best layup in the game, just so you guys to know. I don't want, I did not want to make a separate video just talking about this Jamal Crawford layup because I've already mentioned to you guys previously in other videos the best layup in the game. It has a built-in ankle breaker. Go ahead and try it out. And I just wanted to share with you guys a quick tip: if you guys are driving to the basket and you want to dunk with your left hand, all you want to do is hold down that right trigger while you're driving to the basket and flick your right analog stick to the left. If you want to dunk it with your right hand, hold down that right trigger and flick your right analog stick to the right. If you want to dunk the ball with two hands, all you want to do is flick your right analog stick while holding down right trigger, of course. Flick it up to activate the two-handed dunks. And to activate the flashy dunks, all you want to do is hold down that right trigger and flick your right analog stick down to activate the flashy dunks. Just a little tip that's going to help you guys out in the future. But nonetheless, guys, if you're new to my YouTube channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. It really does help this channel grow. I appreciate your support. Let's get 300 likes on this YouTube video for me. And as always, guys, that has been your boy, Emperor Mufasa, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.